Hey everybody, this is Paul. This is lesson number 11 in the logarithm tutorial series. And in this lesson, I'm going to give you another example on how to expand logarithms. So we're going to start with log base 2 of x to the third y plus log base 3 of z to the fourth divided by x. And we're going to use properties of logarithms to expand this expression. So the first thing that we want to notice is we have a product inside this argument here. And we learned that you can expand the logarithm of a product so that it's equal to the logarithm of the first part plus the logarithm of the second part. So let's go ahead and expand this. So this becomes the logarithm base 2 of the first part, which is our x to the third, plus the logarithm base 2 of the second part, which is our y. And then we're going to add that to this guy right here. And this one has a fraction in its argument. And we know that when we have a fraction in the argument of a logarithm, that's equal to the logarithm of the numerator minus the logarithm of the denominator. So let's go ahead and separate this one. So this becomes log base 3 of the numerator, which is the top, z to the fourth, minus log base 3 of our denominator, and x is in the denominator. And so we've expanded this a little bit, but we can do a little bit more. We've also learned that anytime you have an exponent in your argument, you can take that exponent and move it out front. So we can do that to both of these two terms. You can bring the 4 out front and the 3 out front. And so this becomes 3 times log base 2 of x. The 3 got moved out front, and everything else stayed in the same spot. And log base 2 of y is already simplified, so we're just going to leave it. And here we can bring the 4 out front. So this becomes plus 4 log base 3 of z. And minus our final term, log base 3 of x stays the same. So this was just another short example on using properties of logarithms to expand an expression of logarithms. So basically, log base 2 of x to the third y plus log base 3 of z to the fourth x is equivalent to saying 3 times the log base 2 of x plus log base 2 of y plus 4 log base 3 of z minus log base 3 of x. This entire line is the exact same thing as this line up here, just written in a slightly different form. So thanks for watching. You guys have a great day, and uh, stay tuned for some more uh, math tutorials. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you uh, can go ahead and get all of my tutorials as I put them out. So anyway, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.